Hi, this is Matthew Mead, and this is a quick review of the new Axis Camera Station 5.35 release. Let's take a look at some of the new features. In this release, we have improved the integration to the T8705 decoder. We can now select multiple split views and send them to the decoder. As well as selecting multiple cameras from the camera tree, we can also mix this as well with cameras and views, therefore making the integration far more flexible. A new feature that we've introduced is the ability to record video streams. Here you can see the different formats that are supported and this gives extra flexibility when attaching different devices to Axis Camera Station. The most exciting addition to this release is Axis Control. Once you've added an Axis A1601 door controller, you can configure the unit within Axis Camera Station. Here we can see a door controller has been added and I can configure all of the door furniture that is connected to the device. Here is the operator element, Axis Management. Here you can add card holders, the details of the card holder, including a, an image and the credentials that are used within the door. Axis rules are created that contain uh, the doors and you can simply drag and drop card holders onto the rules to enable access. You can also create groups, for example, for staff or cleaners for simple management. As we have unified both access control and surveillance together, we can get many benefits. Here you can see as a card is presented, we get live details of who has entered and a presentation of the card holder. We also present door alarms such as door forced or door held open for too long directly into access camera station. The final element is data search. Here, the data search can be used to search for card holders and the relevant video that is linked to that access control event. I hope this video has explained the new user features within Access Camera Station 5.35. Thanks for watching.